So you might be trying to figure out how you can convert a heek file or a heic file to a jpeg on your iphone now the heek or he's whatever you want to call them those are the native file types for iphones and they're good they're high efficiency or whatever but you're better off using a jpeg now i've had some success by doing it on my mac but if you want to do it on your iphone you can it's a very easy process all you're going to want to do is you want to go and open up your safari browser on your iphone just like this and you want to go and type in heek to jpeg converter so there's a lot of services that allow you to do this i think i've used like photoshop a lot but if you don't have photoshop you can do this completely for free so click on one of these websites in this case i'll just click on the first one and what you can do here is you can go and bring in that heek file so i can go and click on photo library and i can go and find the file that i want to go and bring in so in this case let's say this was a heek file that i can go ahead and bring in well i can go and click on that file right here that photo i can go and click add and what will happen is it'll go ahead and bring in that specific photo and I can click got it or whatever. It's going to take a second or two. Now this is already a JPEG it looks like or maybe it's not JPEG, I don't know. But you can bring in whatever type of the heek files that you have. So if it's a multiple of them, well what you can do is you can bring them in and now you can see it will go ahead and automatically convert it into a JPEG file. Now it's still 1.4 megabytes, so it's still a fairly large photo. So if you're doing this to like thousands of photos, it can take a long, like a long time. So that's why I would probably recommend using some sort of Mac software that can probably do this. So now what you can do is you can go click the download. Now this photo will be downloaded. Well, you have to hold it down first. So hold it down, click on save to photos. And then what you can do is if you go back into your photos, you'll see that I have this file. And if I go ahead and click on the eye, you will see that it is a JPEG. So it'll say somewhere that it's a JPEG file, probably, I'm probably not even know, but that is basically how it's done. Super easy process, doesn't really take too much time. So you can see right here, it is a JPEG. So. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.